Guess I let you co-star If I gotta do it, I'ma do the most Since they paid to see a show Got the sauce overflow, yeah If I gotta do it, I'ma do the most Watch me to take no raise a toast to the goal, yeah Hey everyone, this is Kelly with Kelly's Reactions. Hope everyone's doing great today. Yes, we're doing another tool. I have gotten into listening to them recently and I want to listen to more but before we get going please subscribe please like and comment down below if you have a song you want me to react to please put it in the comments and I'll get back to you as soon as I can so we're doing tools eulogy and from what I read it's actually not about Jesus it came out in 1998 uh roughly uh from what I've read and what I've looked up it's rumored that this song was about Kurt Cobain or Tool's old former bass player, Paul D'Amour, if I'm saying that right. I can't read my handwriting, so I apologize. <laughs> but that's kind of strange how, you know, rumor would have it, it would be about Kurt Cobain or the old bassist, but we never know. I mean, unless someone out there legitly knows. Um, but yeah, I thought we'd give this one a try. It was suggested in my comments, so we are add we added this on to the list. So let's get started. wanted to stop it real quick so the little jar tinklings and the um then all of a sudden that didn't didn't din, din, like that you know it's almost kind of like they're overlapping these layers of little like little not jingles but little tunes i don't even know what the correct word is but you know what i'm saying is you know they start off with one little noise that they're making with an instrument or non or non-instrument um, and then they add another, then another, and then eventually, boom, you know, that's kind of what I'm hoping to expect. But either way, I just love when people bring in these different little layers and textures to their music. how it's coming in slow, it's building. So I just had to pause real quick because I 
even over my headphones and music, I could hear a really loud noise coming from outside there. So I'm so sorry. I had to go check it out. So I'm the only one here today. So let's continue. So sorry.
Wow. Oh my God. Cool. It's really growing on me, especially at the beginning. One little note of whatever they're clinking on, uh, whether it's an instrument or just using some type of thing for a sound effect or what have you, but it was like gradual one thing, then another thing got added on, then another thing got added in then anything. It's, it's almost like they were introducing each thing they were using within the song, you know, as time went on. And it's so mind blowing how I just love his voice. I can't describe it. I'm not comparing it to anybody else because so far tools, music is remotely their own. They don't sound like anyone else. They don't try to sound like anyone else. They're just more original. They just dig deep for whatever they want to make known to us in their songs and their music. I'm just so, I'm just amazed. I just can't get over it. I, you know, I've heard of them, but I never really listened to them. But now doing these reactions, just listening and just listening to the music and everything you know, all combined is freaking amazing. I think they've got so much talent. They do things different outside the box. Love it. So if you have any more Tool songs, please keep them coming. Please subscribe. Please like and comment down below if you have a song you want me to react to, and I'll get to it as soon as I can. Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate you. Have a great day. Yes, I let you coast. If I gotta do it, I'ma do the most.